Day 84, 21st of August. We had a late night catching up on photos and the blog, so we slept until 8am. Breakfast was included in our charge, which was a bonus, and checkout wasn't until 11am. Another bonus. We finally get going and head out to Halls Harbour. We drive through blueberry country. Pick your own. I may have been tempted, but we bought some last night, and they are big, sweet blueberries. Wow, we found a treasure at Halls Harbour. This is Halls Harbour in the Bay of Fundy, where they have the highest recorded tides in the world. The boats were sitting in the mud at the low tide, and the tide was just starting to come in. I knew there was a reason for our late start today. And oh my, a lobster restaurant on the wharf. What will we do to fill in some time until the middle of the day, till the tide comes in? We made an executive decision. Lobster for lunch and picnic for dinner. We got to choose our own fresh lobster, put it in a container and take it through the kitchen where the chef prepared it for our lunch. And it was delicious. Feeling very relaxed, we head for Lunenburg on the east coast. Just one stop, Mahoney Bay, founded in 1754, but now a bay for the rich and famous. Every pier was private, chained, keep out signs. We are so not used to that, but it's oh so stunning. Are my eyes turning green? Who wouldn't want a private pier across the road from their house with deck chairs on it and a tender tied to it and a big boat on the mooring beside it? Then the village. Mahoney Bay, just north of Lunenburg. Such a mixture of architecture, Irish, Scottish, English and American. So uniquely different from everything we've seen so far and yet so similar. Check out the photos. Just another 10 kilometres to Lunenburg. We are becoming masters at getting sidetracked. We drive through the waterfront. You can't see me, but I'm jumping up and down. This port is a mini St. John's. I'm so excited. I can't wait for tomorrow to see it all. But it is late in the day and most things are closed. And my friend, Mr. Seafog, has just arrived. I'm sure he's following us. Now, find a motel and have our picnic for dinner. May even watch a movie tonight. Something we have not done for a while. 